Hi beastie, so I just got home from work, but before work I went to Kmart trying to find another like hanger to be able to hang the clothing on for my Rainbow High Dolls. I couldn't end up finding the hanger that looks like um, Avery's one, which is unfortunate, but I did find Miss Glam, which isn't even released yet um, in the US, let alone Australia. So I am absolutely shocked to see her here. So happy to though. Crazy how that happened. We only just got Rainbow High Series 2 to Australia. I don't even have River yet, even though I'm looking everywhere for River. Like, yet here we are with Miss Glam. Now I'm going to try and open this without destroying the box because obviously I want to keep it. This is so cute. Alrighty. Oh my gosh. Okay. So it has confetti. <laughs> That's so cute. Oh, and it's got these little presents and it, it squishes. Okay. So it's got like a little bow there little cute patterns and they squish but you have to be careful which side the spring goes like that make sure that you're careful with that for kids i think i probably have confetti in my hair um oh there's also this kind of like leopardy print one. Oh, this is a little bit broken there we go also does that that's really cute that's so fun this is like oh these could be like little stim toys can you imagine how good these will be for neurodivergent kids who need stim toys? Oh my gosh, that's amazing. I'm so impressed. Okay, I was not expecting that. That is so funny. I should have though, um, because I, I knew that um, Grizza had dolls, like a doll that had confetti and it popped in her cars she was trying to open it they're like little blue and yellow and little square rectangle yellow ones you know what that is that's pansexual pride and pride month too yeah it came out of that storage compartment very violently <laughs> i was not expecting it that is the box art there look how gorgeous the art is i absolutely adore it she looked fantastic and she's got this little thing here. Let's have a look at this, shall we? It says, you're invited celebrating Miss Glam. And then on the other side, it has Miss Glam's birthday. How adorable is that? So it's just a typical box for a an LOL doll, but it's got more like art on the front, obviously. And it's also got the bow, which underneath has happy birthday. So it can be given like that as a birthday gift. Uh, if you are gifting it, to your child or maybe your child is giving it as a gift to their friend so i've gotten these out but i'd like to uh first show the dresser the the room so as you can see in there you've got all of the best dolls yeah i'm not gonna name them all because to be honest i'm too scared of getting their names wrong and being a fake fan so I'm not gonna do that, because <laughs> uh, I only have Roller Chick. Okay, so she's standing in there like that. She looks so beautiful in there like that. I gotta say, her stock photo does not do justice. Look, her makeup is beautiful. It's like this blue, her eyes are like popping with that blue color. Her dress, amazing, I have to say. As far as I can see, I don't like the skirt. Not the, the silver one is cute, but I'm not sure how I feel about the blue frilly skirt so far, but I haven't witnessed in person yet. These, okay, so there's like balloons down here, little disco ball balloons, the birthday cake on the inside, pillows, like cushions. It's like set up to be a really cute birthday party. And of course the change room has the mirror. Typical change room. Let's have a look at the other side. Yep. Typical um, LOL OMG change room. Very, very cute, well packaged, fun play set for your kids. And it's very much um, birthday orientated. So if you were getting this for someone's birthday, 
absolutely go for it. Um, and then when it closes up, it just goes and slides back. Let's begin by getting the doll out of her plastic prison, as I like to call it. All right, start with the back stand. It is the regular stand, sparkly blue. It's really pretty. I am a sucker for a pretty looking stand. This one is more of an aqua color and there is only one of these waist pieces. Let's have a little bit of a closer look to her, shall we? So her hair's super curly, which is absolutely gorgeous. It should be curly like that. I want to see this type of hair with rainbow high dolls. I haven't seen, like we haven't seen that in any of the dolls and we know it's possible because MGA has done it. We've seen it and it'd be nice to be able to see it in other dolls. All right, let's have a little look at the skirt. So it's a kind of shimmery silver skirt, and then it's got like the little blue sequiny things, and it's around there, but it doesn't connect on the back. My earring came off, that is not good. Okay, well I have lost an earring, that's unfortunate. And then the straps, the silver straps are like elastic, silver elastic. Her hairpin? says party. Oh my gosh, my camera does not focus. Her hairpin says party and it's like a little silver hairpin. So cute. Her eyeshadow is so pretty. So you can't really see it on camera here because I'm just using my phone, but it's like a shimmery. It's got purpley undertones to the sparkle in certain lights, but it's also got blue. So that tells me that they've actually like really thought about the colors they're using in this because obviously they're going for a blue thing and blue and purple work really well <sighs> back to these again <laughs> it's so fun so i just finished filming this video and i was packing up and i found another one of the present boxes uh this one's pink and it's got like little confetti things on it it flew all the way up into my jewelry up here um all right, let's have a look at her, like this, this stuff. I love this. This is very, it, it's bowling. It's the bowling pin floor. That's what it is. This, this is carpet on the floor. So this is also the chairs for buses. So I think I'll be able to get her arm through it. But it's like a blue little thing. We've got this, it says party on it. I'm gonna fluff it up a little bit. So it's three different layers. If you look underneath, it's, you know, mesh. There's mesh there and it's layered three different colors of it. <gasps> oh, so there's a little bow. When you first open it, also there's a stripey. Um, oh, it's got grooves, you can feel it. I'm pretty sure that's like with all of them. I'm. Oh, it's, okay, this is stretchy. So it should be able to go around fairly easily. Okay, so she's got these little glasses like she does in the thing, the thing, the picture. So it's blue, like an aquary blue, and then the shades themselves, they're black. The sparkles are purple. So she has little gloves. These are adorable. I wish I had these gloves. It's got the little knuckle holes and it just opens up like this, like a Polly Pocket used to. It's like a like a studded diamond looking type of thing. It kind of looks like a choker. That is what it is. It's a, it's a diamond choker. She's got extra little hairpins that you've got to put in. They all say different things. This one says glam, says XOXO. This one says yes. This one also says yeah. This one says happy. And then there are earrings. So this one says LOL and the other one this is another one, a hairpin that says Queen. I'm pretty sure there's supposed to be another earring. Uh, it shows that on the box art. This is a cute little box. And then obviously on the side here, it's got the little labels. That is really, really hard to see. On it, it says no heel boots, six and a, size six and a half, showing like really tall boots. And then the little barcode says, Happy day to you. So it's supposed to be like, happy birthday to you. Oh, uh, you can't see it because my camera doesn't focus. Oh, I forgot to show the wrapping for this one. This one's just blue with the confetti. This one's pink with the confetti. Oh my gosh. Okay, I've just seen, seen why it said no heel boots. There is no heel. 
she's just standing like that i don't know how she's standing it's not even like wedges it's literally like just the base are you okay how do you do it all day so her skirt i'm having issues with it it's kind of sitting up now there is also this little pink package that you get with the things it's got a little heart uh, that says present surprise so it's got the little um turquoise aquari bow on it and the handbag itself is black it's got like a studded feel it's really nice to touch actually the this is actually a chain you can't really see it well but it, it is a chain and then inside it says shh it's a surprise party so it looks like it's supposed to be an invitation oh my gosh this is fun so there's perfume inside of her bag a little bit of like makeup supplies you've got nail polish um another a foundation brush her keys and then her phone is cracked let me show you the different styles that i can put her in okay so i've changed her skirt um <sighs> This little, the little bit there was stuck inside of her leg. So it was kind of hard to get off, but hopefully that's just my experience and not other people's. So I've just put her skirt on. It's really, like, it's loud. It's loud and it looks a bit, it sits a bit strange. It sits quite high up on her, as you can see. I'm not so sure how I feel about it right now. I'm going to put her jacket on so she looks like what she does in... The box art okay i have got it on um it looks like what they were trying to do there was make it look like a bow but also connect it into the shirt i think it would have been cute if it was like out like that and down um because it looks like they were trying to go for something like lady gaga or something i'm not really sure where they were trying to go with that okay i prefer this a lot more i think i just don't like the skirt the, the shirt thing, it matches the bow, so it kind of works. It's got like this purpley kind of undertone to it too. I've taken her hands off, but that's her with the shirt on and the grey uh, silvery skirt. I'm not sure if I like it. I thought I was going to like the silvery skirt on her more. So this blue skirt also sits over the silver one quite well. I feel like that's a bit cuter with that, with the, the grey rather than the silver. Okay, I'm not sure how I feel about the grey shirt with the blue jumper on there. It feels like they're not matching. I'm going to take skirt off now and suddenly that is very mismatched. So my thoughts on what works best, I think the two grey pieces, the so silvery sparkly pieces, and the jacket are cute. And then I also think the blue frilly dress and the gray shirt is nice. I think those are the cutest combinations. I am missing an earring. I'm not sure why. Ironically enough, we're missing the same ear. See, <laughs> we're matching. So that is Miss Glam unboxed. Very interesting how she looks i think she's really cute and she is a fantastic idea but i'm not so sure about the execution of the fashion it could possibly have been a bit better i don't really i don't really mind though i think it works if you style it correctly put on the things that you think she looks best with uh thanks for watching my video oh my gosh my light just turned off comment your thoughts on miss glam tell me what you think about her i mean if you're new to the channel like and subscribe besties as as they they all say um yeah thank you for watching drink water stay safe and i love you have a great day bye